St. Louis may not be in the path of totality. We know that, but we are close enough to see 99% of the sun get covered. And just a short road trip, just about an hour away, will put you in 100% totality. So when totality happens, we will have crews throughout the path, including in Chester, Illinois. Total darkness there is set for 1.58 p.m. And our Nathan Vickers shows us how that town is getting ready. Small towns in the Midwest. People in town are so welcoming. Possess a certain character. I call that warm, fuzzy uh, feeling like extended family everywhere you go. But for Mike McClure and others in Chester, Illinois, there's one particular character that stands out. Welcome to Chester, Illinois, the home of Popeye the Sailor Man. It's the birthplace of Elsie Cigar, the artist behind the spinach swilling strongman and a cast of crazy companions. They were based on his friends and family, extended family, when he lived here. That includes Frank Fiegel, not a real sailor, but an inspiration in a different way. He was exactly what Popeye was, a small man, but extremely strong, legendary. Cigar's cartoon creations are all over town including 19 granite statues of olive oil, Bluto, and Wimpy. <laughs> I'll gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. And just about every other oddball from the original comic strip. I think it inspires everybody, no matter what you are or who you are, where your talent might lie, you don't have to be the football star. There's another kind of inspiration coming to Chester, less comic and more cosmic. A total eclipse where the moon completely covers the sun is very, very unique. We're unique. We have it twice in a lifetime. Patty Carter is part of the team preparing for Chester's second round of moon gazing. Oh, we're going to have a great time. We really are. It's going to be party city. Along with longtime residents like Cynthia Lauder. I'm just anxious to see what people, how they react to the eclipse and how they react to coming to Chester. Totality of the eclipse will only last a few minutes, but people in Chester are hoping visitors will stay for a few days to check out local shops and businesses, maybe spending some time learning about the town's history or stopping to take a photo. Don't just come that one day. We want you to come spend the night, experience the town. Uh -oh. They see it as a showcase. Right now we're just getting everything cleaned up, getting ready to go. That's why they're getting ball fields ready for crowds of viewers. It's awesome that we can get as many people in here as we can. They're expecting hundreds to camp in their parks. So this time it almost seems easier. And they're rolling out the Popeye-themed Eclipse swag. Chester's unique, and that's what I want to show, how special we are. You might say they're over the moon. We want them, to, when they leave here, to be happy and feel like they can go tell somebody what a good time they had. To show off the town a second time. It's this little microcosm of a sort of a place. A place where a cast of characters is only part. You can feel like family that you hadn't met before of its true character in Chester, Illinois, Nathan Vickers, first alert for